Hello and welcome back. In this video, I'm going to show you how to assemble this DIY Packraft spray deck kit and attach it to your Packraft. Start by separating the fabric pieces using scissors where necessary. Lay out the oval shaped fabric rings and mark the center line on the TPU side of each one. Set aside the narrower ring and lay out the wider ring TPU side up. Arrange the four curved fabric pieces over the wider ring TPU side down so there's one centimeter of TPU exposed on each side of the curved pieces. Use your iron to heat seal the four curved pieces to the ring, being careful to keep them centered as you go. Next, we're going to seal the edges of the two combing rings together so they form a single ring with a C-shaped cross section, shaped sort of like a bicycle tire. We want the TPU sides of the two rings to face in the same direction, so we'll have to overlap the edges like this in order to make a TPU to TPU bond, shown here in red. Start by lining up the center line of each of the two combing rings overlapping the outer edges by one centimeter, TPU to TPU, and then seal a short straight section together. Continue sealing the two rings together as shown, doing your best to match up the corners. This is the most challenging part of this project, so take your time, and don't worry if you have to iron in a small wrinkle now and then to force the corners to line up. To make things easier, you may find it worthwhile to create a 1 cm wide form to drape the fabric over, but I didn't bother. Continue sealing all the way around until you have a single ring with a C-shaped cross section. Check the seal and revisit any areas that need more ironing. Now set the combing aside and measure and mark one centimeter out from each corner of the cockpit hole on the TPU side of the spray deck fabric. Align the combing over the cockpit hole with the wider ring on top and the exposed TPU facing down. Your combing ring may be inside out after sealing the two rings together, so turn it right side out if necessary. The bottom ring should line up easily with the marks you made on the deck fabric, one centimeter from the cockpit opening. Tack the bottom of the combing ring to the spray deck in a band about one centimeter or half an inch wide, all the way around the cockpit opening. You don't have to get a perfect seal here yet, because we'll iron it from the bottom later. Then seal the top of the combing to the deck fabric. Leave one of the straight sections unsealed on either the left or right side of the cockpit to create an opening through which you'll be able to insert and remove the plastic tubing later on. Once you've ironed all the way around the cockpit, flip the deck over so you can give it a once over with your iron from the bottom as well. Use the full width of your iron so you can seal the deck fabric to both combing rings. Just remember not to seal over that one section of the top ring we want to leave open. You could slide some parchment paper in there to prevent the layers from being welded together.
Reinforce each end of the opening by ironing in a small scrap of fabric like so. Fold it in half so it seals to both the deck fabric and the combing ring. You can insert similar reinforcing pieces between the deck fabric and the underside of the combing ring as well. The more white water you expect to encounter in your adventures, the more reinforcing you should add here. Now you're ready to attach the deck to your pack raft. Inflate the pack raft and align the corners of the deck fabric over the seam strips. Use masking tape to hold the deck in place and adjust it until you've eliminated as many wrinkles as possible. Cut seam strips to fit the edges of the deck and use them to join the deck to the inflated tube fabric. The strips should be centered over the perimeter of the deck, so half of each strip seals to the deck fabric and half seals to the tube fabric. Work your way from one end of the pack raft to the other, removing and adjusting the masking tape as necessary to create a nice smooth deck. In this example video, the ring around the inflation valve interferes with the spray deck, but I've updated the location of the valve to prevent this from happening, so it shouldn't be a problem for you. Slide the plastic tube into the combing through the slot you left unsealed, and trim off a small piece at a time until it fits snugly in the sleeve without being too difficult to insert and remove. As soon as I find a suitable connector to fit this type of tubing, I'll start including one in each kit, but for now, I find a short section of pencil works really well. To create a watertight seal at the corners of the deck, where TPU to TPU welds aren't possible, you'll need to use an adhesive such as Seam Grip, Aqua Seal, or AquaSure. Tape the corners down while the glue cures. That's all for this video. If you found it useful, please hit the like button. In the next video, I'll show you how to make a spray skirt to fit this deck. Thanks for watching.